Question 16. We know roll-up component in ab initio is used to summarize group of data record then why do we use aggregation? Answer. O aggregation and roll-up, both are used to summarize the data, O roll-up is much better and convenient to use, O roll-up can perform some additional functionality, like input filtering and output filtering of records. O aggregate does not display the intermediate results in main memory, whereas roll-up can, O analyzing a particular summarization is much simpler compared to aggregations. Question 17. What kind of layouts does Abinitio support? Answer. O Abinitio supports serial and parallel layouts. O A graph layout supports both serial and parallel layouts at a time. O the parallel layout depends on the degree of the data parallelism. O A multi-file system is a four-way parallel system. O A component in a graph system can run four-way parallel system. Question 18. How do you add default rules in Transformer? Answer. The following is the process to add default rules in Transformer. O double click on the transform parameter in the parameter tab page in component properties. O click on edit menu in transform editor. O select add default rules from the drop down list box. O it shows match names and wildcard options. Select either of them. Question 19. How to run a graph infinitely? Answer. To run a graph infinitely, O the .ksh graph file should be called by the end script in the graph. O if the graph name is abc.mp then the graph should call the abc.ksh file. Question 20. What is a local lookup? Answer. O local lookup file has records which can be placed in main memory. O they use transform function for retrieving records much faster than retrieving from the disk. Question 21. What is a lookup? Answer. Lookup or a lookup file represents a set of serial files, flat files or a lookup as a specific data set that is keyed, or the key is used for mapping values based on the data available in a particular file or the data set can be static or dynamic, or hash joins can be replaced by reformatting and any of the input in lookup to join should contain less number of records with a slim length of records or ab initio has certain functions for retrieval of values using the key for the lookup. Question 22. What is a ramp limit? Answer. O A limit is an integer parameter which represents a number of reject events or ramp parameter contain a real number representing a rate of reject events of certain processed records or the formula is, no of bad records allowed equals limit plus no of records x ramp O A ramp is a percentage value from 0 to 1, O these two provides the threshold value of bad records. Question 23. What is a roll-up component? Explain about it. Answer. O roll-up component allows the users to group the records on certain field values. O it is a multi-stage function and contains O initialize to. Roll-up 3. Finalize functions which are mandatory or to counts of a particular group. Roll-up needs a temporary variable or the initialize function is invoked first for each group or roll-up is called for each of the records in the group. O the finally function calls only once at the end of last roll-up call. Question 24. Describe the evaluation of parameters order. Answer. Following is the order of evaluation. O host setup script will be executed first or all common parameters, that is, included, are evaluated or all sandbox parameters are evaluated or the project script, project start.ksh is executed or all form parameters are evaluated or graph parameters are evaluated or the start script of graph is executed. Question 25. Explain PDL with an example. Answer. To make a graph behave dynamically, PDL is used or, suppose there is a need to have a dynamic field that is to be added to a predefined DML while executing the graph or, then a graph level parameter can be defined or, utilize this parameter while embedding the DML in output port. Question 26. State the first underscore defined function with an example. Answer. Oh this function is similar to the function NVL in Oracle database or oh, it performs the first values which are not null among other values available in the function and assigns to the variable. Question 27. What are the operations that support avoiding duplicate record? Answer. Duplicate records can be avoided by using the following, or using dudup sort or performing aggregation or utilizing the rollup component. Question 28. What parallelisms does Abinitio support? Answer. Abinitio supports three parallelisms. They are data parallelism. Same data is parallelly worked in a single application component parallelism. Different data is worked parallelly in a single application pipeline parallelism. Data is passed from one component to another component. Data is worked on both of the components. 
Question 29. State the relation between AIM, GDE and co-operating system. Answer. AIM, O AIM stands for Enterprise Metadata Environment or it is a repository to ab initio. It holds transformations, database configuration files, metadata and target information GDE, O GDE, graphical development environment or it is an end user environment. Graphs are developed in this environment or it provides GI for editing and executing ab initio programs cooperative system o cooperative system is the server of ab initio o it is installed on a specific os platform known as native os o all generated graphs in gde are later deployed and executed in cooperative system Question 30. What is a deadlock and how it occurs? Answer. O a graphical program hand is known as deadlock. O the progression of a program would be stopped when a deadlock occurs. O data flow pattern likely causes a deadlock. O if a graph flows diverge and converge in a single phase, it is potential for a deadlock. O a component might wait for the records to arrive on one flow during the flow converge, even though the unread data accumulates on others. O in GDE version 1.8, the occurrence of a a deadlock is very rare.